Hey, what up, guys? It is Mac HD Tutorials here, and uh, today is Monday, April Fool's Day. And this whole entire week, I don't have school, so I'm gonna be doing a JavaScript tutorial every day for this week. Hopefully, by Friday or by Sunday, there's no more Walking Dead. So <laughs> I'm, I am gonna be uploading a tutorial on Sunday if I don't finish this JavaScript series. So yeah, I am planning on finishing this JavaScript series in one day. I mean, in uh, one week. Sorry about that. And uh, <clears throat> let's get started. So last tutorial or episode, whatever you want to call it, we uh, we went over if and else. Now this tutorial, we're going to be going over else if. There's a difference, and I'm going to be explaining it. So we have a basic uh, two variables, username and password. We give them values that username, I mean that the user is going to enter. Now we're going to do a basic if statement. So it, if username equals Mac and password equals pass if both of those conditions are true and if I say condition you know what it means I went over in the last tutorial these are conditions and what goes inside here are statements so I'm going to be using those words because you guys have to get familiar with them so uh, so yeah if those so if those two are true we're going to alert alert member means display so we're going to alert log now we're going to log uh, something valid fail uh, valid login All right. Now we're gonna be doing the else if. So I'm gonna do else if username equals equals Mac. I don't know why I put double quotes. Let me just keep it in one. Scroll down. All right. So. If the username is right, but the password you enter is wrong, we're gonna do alert username is correct, but password is wrong. Then after that, we're gonna do another uh, another uh, else if do if password equals. Pass. If password equals pass, we're gonna do alert. The password was correct, but username was wrong. And one more statement, we're gonna do else. So basically, if the username and the password was wrong, do else put brackets else alert both username and password are wrong side face don't forget that side face it has to be there <laughs> just joking uh, let's try this it's gonna run it so we're gonna put, I think I put Mac as username and pass, and it's success. So valid login. I'm gonna be going over all the conditions. So that's a valid login right here. Now we're gonna try this one. The else if. Try this again. So we're gonna do Mac and password is gonna be Mac. Username is correct, but password is wrong. That that is what it says right here. Now I'm gonna put the right password but wrong username. Uh, whatever you want and password is pass password is correct but the username is wrong and now for the last one both of them are going to be wrong Oop. wait let me just show the code I don't know why I clicked design <laughs> alright so uh, I'm just going to enter uh, max HD tutorials 
both username and password are wrong. So basically, yeah, it goes on here because it, it says this statement right here. And the reason it says it is because uh, this is not valid or this is not valid and that's not valid. So if both if everything's false, if the username and password is not Mac or pass, if they're not equal to 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 this right here, it's gonna go straight to to just else. And I'll see how much time we have left. Five minutes. So uh, yeah, I guess that's it for today. And tomorrow we're gonna be going over nested if and else statements and we're also going to be doing introducing loops so we're going to do two things in one tutorial tomorrow and uh see you then peace out brah